Right, so just a short video on this one. You can see the rigging's coming on now. Got lots of it done. Still a bit to do on the foremast. But I just want to show you how to use a rigging tool, which I showed you in a previous video. But this is a rigging tool. Can't get to focus, oh yeah. That's one end of it, and that is the other end of it, and it's used for, you can see in there, the pin rail, it just helps you to get things threaded around there, get them looped on. So we've got the foremast one, if you remember I made these, they weren't actually in the kit. When I made these because of those ridiculous things they had to go in the crow's nest for putting the some of the rigging round but I brought them brought them all down right to the bottom to the deck and using the pin rail so I'm going to try and show you how to do that so this zoomed in. Zoom out again a minute. So I've got this one tied off to the bottom of the top sail here. And this one goes up and through that block there. And then it's going to go all the way down through the crow's nest. Again, the camera caught in the rigging, sorry. All the way down and be fastened off on that pin rail there. So we'll just get that threaded through. And then this goes up and through there. There we go. And then it needs to go down behind the rigging and through the crow's nest. Speed that through, pull that down. And that sail wants to be lifted up to the balance when we get the other side done, but I need it bent up away from the, uh, the bottom one. This other one that holds it down through this block, I haven't got that tied off yet, so that's, that's still loose. I can find it, that one. Pull that down a little bit. There we go. Right, now I'm going to put the camera around the other side. So you can see what I'm doing in there. Hopefully this time it will stay in focus. Actually if I zoom in on it. Right, let's make sure it's in focus. Yeah, there we go. Right, so I've got it coming down there. So that's the one we want. Comes right down to there. Right. So what you need to do is, just do the focus there, yeah. yeah. Right, so I'm keeping hold of the end of the thread to keep some tension on it. And then, use this hook piece 
and it needs to go we'll use this end pin rail here so you can get it underneath it like that and then it needs to go through there and you can put using this end of the thing you can push and pull with it depending on which way you've got it turned get it underneath the collar then hook it again round underneath again keep the tension on it with your other hand a bit tricky but it will go like that and then to tie it up and if you've got if you've got it waxed it will keep its shape and it will keep under there it'll hold it there look and then what you need to do is twist wrong way twist it that way put a twist in it just spin it round until it goes okay there we go and then you need to get in there That. And look at that over the top. It is tricky, but I don't think you'll do it without a rigging tool. There we go. Gently ease it in, keeping it pushed down. Again, push it down over the collar. then just change hands using the same tool same end of it pull it down tight there we are job done so it's not too difficult you can get the hang of it you just got to practice a bit and uh, you'll get it mm -hmm.